Uh, tell us how to cook that. How long you been here, man? That's, first of all, I want to get I've been that. here there 65 years. No kidding. Yeah. Well, that means you must be at least 65 years old then. A little bit younger. <laughs> you I'm started? I'm you, 77. Are you kidding me? No. Man, I'm 77 you, in March. You've been rolling, huh? I've been rolling. You know what? I love what I do. Now, what is it? Is it good uh, beer? The beer around here to keep you young? I don't. I never drank in my life. No. I used to smoke, but I stopped 15 years ago. No kidding. Well, that's good. I drink just water. No pop. No nothing. Just water. That's why you're in such good shape. Yeah. Okay. You want me to start cooking? Yeah. All right. You put your uh, big tablespoon of cooking oil in your pot. All right. On medium. Medium. And you, and you chop you about half a head of a. Onions, I don't put too much. Uh, onion like this, I'm going to take half of half. With two pieces of uh, bell pepper big like this. Chop that up. Put that in there. And two cloves of garlic. On medium? Yeah. For how long? Yeah, you saute that in your cooking oil. About what? Five, five, ten minutes. When it starts getting sauteed, put in your crawfish. And put you, you season it with pepper and red pepper. And you put your little bit of paprika. Not a lot. Put your, drop your crawfish in there, and you stir that up, and as long as there's water in there, don't add no water. On a medium speed. When the water is all gone, put that back on my stove. I have a stove. I put that on about, on about, uh, it's five, and the low is about five. Put that on low, I say about five. Put that on low, add your little bit of water, and stir it, and let it simmer. When it start going, go back. Put another little bit of water in there so that makes your gravy. Put a little bit of water and the cooking oil, and then half an hour is cooked, you can eat it. A half an hour after? Because so that's on simmer? That cook is already cooked, the crawfish is No, hard. no, I know, but then you, you, you put it on. Uh, so. Now you put it on low. Low. Very low. You got the sauce, the gravy is going to leave. And you put a top on it? No, I don't put no? a top on that, no. You don't need to put a top on no. it? No, I don't put a top on that. So, okay, so and after you, you put the same. crawfish, start it from the crawfish again. Uh-huh. So you put the crawfish in after you simmer, yeah. after you saute the yeah. vegetable. Yeah. You put, you put your crawfish, and then crawfish makes water. Let that water come out, and then you're going to see the grease come up on top of the crawfish. You see that? Because it takes, you know. Add your little bit of water, lower that thing down, and let it simmer for about half an hour. And you put the seasoning with the crawfish with or before? With the crawfish, with, with the crawfish. Red pepper, I use red pepper and salt. I don't use black pepper. And, uh, and, the, 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 and paprika. The paprika. A now, little bit of paprika. Like, you know, like you'd be using red pepper? Like they say, well, you put your paprika in there like you're using your red pepper. Okay, move, Jeff. Now, now let, let me, uh, that's the camp style at your Yes, dear. And uh, so Nash, what about that grits and griot? You know how the, the griot? The griot, that's, that's the meat? Yeah, it's a pork meat. Yeah, I mean, you cook that the same way like I just told you. Yeah, but what else and you put in? That's it. You put a marinated it. pork, I That's think. it. You put your cooking oil. And when, the, hot, when the, the grease is hot, you put in your griot in there. It's already seen. Put a little bit of paprika to make it a little, that gravy gets brown. Okay. And you have to stir your meat in there until it's brown. After your meat is brown, then you add your onions, bell pepper, and garlic. Then you stir that in there, you know? And when you think it's cooked enough, not a lot, when you think it's, it's simmer enough, add your water, add your water to, uh, uh, to almost cover that meat and cover that meat, okay? Cover, on, cover the cover top. Cover the meat, cover the top. On medium, but don't, don't wait too long before you go and see what it is. Open that up the cover, and if there's not enough water, add you some more water and cover it and you stir it. And that gravy is going to be brown, brown, brown. It's, but but it, there's no roux, it almost uh, like a roux. No roux. No roux. It seems like it almost has it though, the okay, gravy. You stir that in that pot there, your meat there is going to come brown. You don't put any water or your hand until that meat is brown. That meat has to be brown. Well, that's some good stuff that griot, huh? Almost as good as this. Yes, yes. And I cook, I cook sirloin steak like that. I cook shrimp like that. I cook, uh, I raise my own chicken. I cook my chicken in a like that. 
Chicken ain't too fat. Oh, that's delicious, but I raised my own chicken. I can't cook this chicken in the store, that's not good. I can't cook that. It's all breaks in the pot and uh, I, I, I don't eat that. It's all pieces 